everyone, I'm Joey from Hansat Gallery of Clay Skirt and today I'm going to share with you on air dry clay and clay dough. Let's take a look! Sometimes by looking at the air dry clay and play dough, we can't see the difference. So let me share with you what should we take note. So for air dry clay and play dough, it can make beautiful creations just like the ice cream in front of me and other creations too that you and your little one can create together and have a great bonding time. What should we take note when we use the air dry clay and the play dough? Both air dry clay and the play dough is soft and is very suitable for children. Do take note that for play dough, when it's dry, it will crumble and it will lose its initial shape. But for air dry clay, once it dries, it will harden. Like this, it will harden and it's able to stay its shape. And for air dry clay, Please take note that you have to leave it air dry for at least one day after you are done so it will be hardened and you can set up learning corners or set up playtime for your little ones. Do take note for air dry clay, if you leave outside for a period of time, it will harden. So if you are not using, please put it in the ziplock bag and tighten it so you can use it again. So for both air dry clay and play dough, they can mix colors and it's good for teaching young children color mixing. So this is air dry clay. It can make so red and blue mix proper. And it helps to build their fine motor skills, their fingers, by stretching the clay. So you get red and blue mix purple. And we have the play dough over here, which also can use to pitch colors. Mixing colors. So we have blue and yellow mixed green. So this is good for color mixing. And now I'm going to show you when you want to stick together what we need to take note of for play dough. So if I want to stick my play dough together, okay. It might be not sticky because when it dry, it will um, crack. So it's not really sticky and when you stick together, the colors will stick together for play dough. However, for air dry clay, okay, we want to stick it together. Okay, have to position it well before you stick together. If you want to stick and then you take out, it might stain the color like this. Okay. It will stick together. So you have to position it well first before you stick. Okay. And do take note for play dough after finish your creation. You cannot leave it outside for too long because it might spoil the play dough. So what you need to do is you have to keep the play dough in a ziplock bag. Okay. So you have to keep the play dough in a ziplock bag. Okay. So you can use it again. And for air dry clay, if you are not using any balance, okay, also the same thing, keep into a ziplock bag. Okay, so for those that bought the play dough in the store, okay, what you need to do is you have can keep in a ziplock bag. But let's say for homemade play dough, what you can do is you can zip, keep in a ziplock bag and put in the fridge. So we have come to the end of sharing what to take note for play dough and air dry clay. So have fun with your little one with your beautiful creations.